Members of the Roots community supported agriculture, bring fresh and organic vegetables to local Asian communities every other weekend. So we are providing culturally relevant food. Um, a lot of our vegetables, um, it's if you wouldn't be able to find in an American market. We have a pound of mizuna. Um, it's a Japanese green. They were all picked up fresh from local California farms. Everything is natural grow. We only have the soy, water, sun. Community members can subscribe to the service for just $60 a season. Then subscribers can receive the fresh produce within miles from their homes. It's way more fresh. Just freshness, overall freshness. After putting the vegetables into the refrigerator for 10 days, the one I got from the CSA looked more fresh than the one I got from the supermarket. Fresh is not the only reason. Subscribers said they want to support local farmers. Renko Fukuda has subscribed to the service for six months. She also volunteers at farms. And I don't take it for granted. It's really hard work. Although there is a farmer's market close to her home, she chooses to be a subscriber and pay up front. It's most expensive for them in the beginning of the season. They have to buy the seeds and, you know, till the, till the farm and get everything ready. And that's when they need the cash. Poor little lady. Yeah. She does the whole stand by herself, you know. Carolyn Muwa is an immigrant from Laos. Every Sunday, her husband drives five hours in the middle of the night to Los Angeles. Saturday, we pack all day and we cook fresh. Roots CSA now has 75 subscribers, and there are about 4,000 CSAs across the country. You're promoting a sense of empowerment within the community it, because it's coming from the community and it's for the community. It's the CSA who brings the fresh vegetables to the Asian communities, but it's the subscribers who bring the communities together. Meng Yijian Yisun, ATVN.